Beethoven's Symphony No. 5, in C minor, Opera 67. You know the theme, da-da-da-dum, motif that has come to represent fate knocking at the door. But there's much more to this symphony than just those famous opening bars. It's a work filled with intensity, drama, and resilience. And it's a testament to Beethoven's genius. Before we dive into symphony number five, let's briefly talk about what a symphony is. A symphony is a large-scale composition for orchestra, typically made up of four movements, each with its own character and mood. The symphonic form allows composers to explore contrasting themes, tempos, and emotions within a unified framework. In Beethoven's Fifth Symphony, each movement plays a crucial role in the overall emotional arc, guiding us from darkness to light, struggle to triumph. Beethoven's Symphony No. 5 was composed between 1804 and 1808, during one of the most turbulent periods in his life. He was coming to terms with his increasing deafness, a devastating condition for a composer. Yet, rather than giving in to despair, Beethoven channeled his emotions into his music, creating some of his most powerful and enduring works. The Fifth Symphony is often seen as a musical representation of struggle and victory, darkness turning into light. It premiered in Vienna in 1808 and was initially met with mixed reactions. However, over time, it became one of the most celebrated symphonies in the history of music, admired for its brilliant structure, emotional depth, and unforgettable themes. Let's break down the structure and themes of Symphony No. 5. The symphony is in four movements, each contributing to a larger narrative of struggle and triumph. First movement, Allegro con brio. The first movement opens with the iconic four-note motif, da 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 dum. This motif, played in C minor, is the driving force behind the entire movement, appearing in different forms and variations throughout. It's filled with tension and urgency, representing a struggle against fate. Beethoven masterfully weaves this motif into every aspect of the movement, creating a sense of relentless drive. As the movement progresses, the orchestra builds in intensity, with rapid dynamic shifts between soft and loud sections. There's a constant push and pull, reflecting the emotional turbulence Beethoven was experiencing in his life. The recapitulation brings back the main theme with even greater force, and the movement concludes with a fiery coda that leaves the listener breathless. Second movement, Andante con moto. In stark contrast to the explosive first movement, the second movement is more lyrical and reflective. It's set in A-flat major, and follows a theme and variations form. The theme itself is elegant and graceful, with a sense of calm and dignity. Throughout the movement, Beethoven introduces subtle variations in the melody, harmony, and orchestration, gradually building in intensity. There's a feeling of quiet strength in this movement, as if the music is reflecting on the challenges faced in the first movement, but with a sense of hope and resolve. Third movement, Scherzo, Allegro.
The third movement returns to the dramatic intensity of the first, opening with a mysterious theme in C minor. The rhythm is quick and light, but there's an underlying sense of suspense, as if something is brewing beneath the surface. Halfway through, Beethoven introduces a contrasting, playful trio section in C major, giving the listener a brief moment of lightness before the tension returns. The movement ends with a quiet, almost eerie transition that leads directly into the fourth movement without a pause. Fourth movement, Allegro. The final movement bursts forth with a triumphant theme in C major, representing the ultimate victory over struggle. The mood is jubilant and powerful, with the full orchestra playing in unison. Beethoven introduces new themes, but there's a sense of resolution throughout the movement, as if all the tension from the previous movements has been resolved. The symphony concludes with a rousing coda, where the orchestra unleashes its full power, bringing the piece to a triumphant and exhilarating finish. The transformation from the dark, ominous opening to this radiant finale is one of the greatest emotional journeys in classical music. Beethoven's Symphony No. 5 is one of the most famous works of Western classical music. Its iconic four-note motif has been referenced in countless films, TV shows, and even pop culture. During World War II, the V for victory sign was used as a symbol of resistance, and the rhythm of da-da-da-dum became associated with the Morse code for the letter V, a perfect reflection of the symphony's spirit of overcoming adversity. I hope this exploration has given you a new perspective on this symphony and the incredible journey Beethoven takes us on through his music. If you enjoyed this episode, please subscribe, share, and leave a comment. Let us know what pieces you'd like us to explore next. Until then, keep discovering the beauty of classical music. <laughs>